For the most part, Albuquerque has always been on the boxing map, and more so now with the success of Danny Romero, Johnny Tapia, Daniel Torres, and others. And tonight, we may have found out why these guys enjoy success in the ring. Because they were boxing kids first. Here's Lee Faria. It was billed as the first annual Albuquerque Boxing Club International Show. Twelve fights in all involving both the big and the small. But the real story of this program is what it offers to kids slash boxers, both past and present. Well, learn you don't got to be hanging out with the gangs and you got to be around alcohol and drugs and stuff like that. Stay going out and, you know, getting in trouble. And you get in the gym and train and look, you know, get in tip-top shape. Most moms taking in tonight's action agree. They'd much rather have their kids in the ring than on the run with a gang. It's keeping them off the streets, like he said. Uh, and getting away from gangs and maybe bad peers, and it's something that I'll let him do. This is where fighters like Danny Romero, Johnny Toppy, and Danny Perez got their start. And they feel they're obligated to be here to support Albuquerque's fighters of tomorrow. Programs like this educate and show uh, the young boxers what there is to do. And uh, by be, being here, I think I believe I show them that uh, you could be successful starting at this level. Something else this program teaches the kids, how to answer those TV reporter questions. He didn't really keep his hands up, and I threw a lot of punches. Just like Danny Romero. In Albuquerque, I'm Lee Faria, Channel 4 Eyewitness Sports. Lee says those little guys really pack a punch. I bet they do. I bet. All right, Jake. And later, the 10 celebrities that make us yawn.